push comes to shove over COVID mandates in LA County. The Board of Supervisors moving against employees who refuse to get their shots as the county also wrestles with opposition to mask mandates. Here is the latest at 11. The CDC says case counts and deaths are still too high to loosen restrictions and ease mandates despite a growing public pushback against them. LA County is taking a similar approach. It won't lift its mask mandate when the state does one week from today. And now LA County supervisors are moving to discipline and deputies and other employees who won't get vaccinated. KTLA 5's John Finolio live in downtown LA with tonight's developments. John. Well, Sharon Micah, this fight has been brewing for months. Sheriff Villanueva has been pushing against the vaccine mandate. Today, the County Board of Supervisors pushed back. Fed up with Sheriff Alex Villanueva's refusal to enforce the county's COVID vaccine mandate, the LA County Board of Supervisors voting 4 to 0 Tuesday on a proposal that would give the county personnel director the authority to fire or discipline deputies who defy the requirement. But there's still about 10,000 that aren't compliant. The sheriff isn't even entering data for his employees. And the sheriff's department has consistently ended up in the basement of the percentage of those people who are vaccinated. For his part, Villanueva has encouraged his staff to get the shot, but has been a vocal critic of the mandate, arguing deputies should have the option of undergoing regular testing. The sheriff himself calling into the meeting ahead of the vote. This is ill-advised, illogical, and probably in the long run illegal. And uh, by the time you figure out the legality of it, we're going to be past the pandemic. Enforcement of the mandate applies to all county employees, not just the sheriff's department. A county attorney telling supervisors he believes the board does have legal authority to act. Supervisor Catherine Barger abstained from voting, saying, quote, This action is in response to an individual, Sheriff Villanueva, to be specific. To change policy over one individual isn't appropriate. According to the county, 83% of all employees are fully vaccinated, just 63% in the sheriff's department. Supervisors arguing unvaccinated personnel will put lives at risk. The sheriff issuing a statement late Tuesday, saying in part, Today, the Board of Supervisors followed through on their threat and voted 4 to 0 to form a suicide pact and start the process to fire 4,000 deputies for not being vaccinated. This is nothing more than another politically motivated stunt by the board, which has no bearing on public health, but will definitely harm public safety. All right, so up next, attorneys for the county must draft amendments to civil service rules and then bring them back to the County Board of Supervisors for full approval. That is slated for March 15th.